Separate evacuation tests have to be performed for the cockpit and for the passenger cabin. 873 volunteer passengers participated in the test, conducted at Airbus's Hamburg facility. As prescribed by the safety rules, the test was conducted using only half of the aircraft doors, while the aircraft was kept in a closed hangar simulating pitch black night conditions. All occupants left the aircraft safely well within the 90 seconds allowed by the rules. Data compiled from the tests are used to study the flow of evacuees on both decks of the A380, through the doors and down the escape slides to the ground. The water injection tests were carried out at Istre Air Force Base at various speeds and also at standstill for the thrust reversers. These tests are designed to evaluate how well the undercarriage sections can evacuate water on a flooded runway without throwing up water into the engines and risking a flameout. A wide variety of specific testing, such as heavy crosswind tests, autoland and early long flights are needed to finalize all necessary compliance demonstrations. The route proving program occurs at the end of the certification flight tests, when the aircraft is ready for commercial service. 150 flight hours are accumulated over an intensive 17-day program that brings the aircraft around the world with stops in Asia, South Africa, Australia and Canada. The flights are conducted in fully representative airline service and support conditions. The A380 is ready for takeoff.